Welcome to Flowers by Vogue. I'm your host Mercedes Sarmini and I am here today to educate you how to utilise what you've got in your front and backyard to bring indoors to enjoy. So let's start. Welcome to Glorious St Ives, located at number 7 Shelby Avenue. The owner, Carol, seems to be out doing some grocery shopping, but that won't stop us from surprising her. A nest or a beautiful display of a school of uh, bluebells, which are very similar to um, hyacinths, but um, easier to work with, I, I believe so, because of the long, naked stem that they do possess. Look at those leaves, just absolutely delightful. Again, as we can see here, some cordial line hiding from the, from the vision of the um, camcorder, but we've sprung it. Oh, one of my favourites. Look at this. This is lupin, and um, it's in the process of flowering. As you can see there, it's quite young, but absolutely divine. I mean, look at look at the leaves. I mean, I am just so excited. Those leaves would be such a focal point in an arrangement. Oh, look at that. Westeria, the most romantic flower ever and it's got such a beautiful perfume that if you're not romantic you'll become romantic just by smelling or even touching it. Look at that, absolutely divine. Okay guys, it's time to cut. Very nice. You want to get turned on? Get close to an orange tree. Orange tree! Yeah! Guys, I know I've just cut it at the uh, stem. But you know what? That can grow shoots if you put it in glass of water for about a month and all of a sudden you start to see some shoots coming at the root section and once you see that you take it out of the water you put it into the ground recycling so this will never die Circumstances like this, we've got no choice. What we're going to do, straight into water. Let's go. guys an arrangement that's just more or less done under 10 minutes between locating what you want in the garden bringing it back to the bench cutting it placing it having a little bit of a fiddle T took 10 minutes just under 10 minutes for me I'd like to give you about half an hour Remember the tip. don't be scared and believe me you'll surprise yourself okay guys earlier in the piece we were told that Carol is out shopping, doing the grocery shopping, and she should be back early afternoon. Some bad news, guys, she still hasn't arrived. So what we've decided to do is to really, really surprise her by placing the arrangements that we did in her backyard garden. We've shifted them from the back to her veranda, just waiting to surprise her as she walks up these stairs smack bang in her face. What do you think? Come on, let's have a look. Let me show you these arrangements. 
As you can see, there's a theme happening here. Earlier in the show, we did the long bars arrangement. And then later in the show, we did the triangular long brick arrangement in the bars. So, um, positioned next to each other, you can see that there's some sort of unity happening here. Same theme, and I'd like to call it the Gothic Romantic Era. How about that, guys? Eat your heart out, and I'm sure Carol will too. You have a good night.